And of course, Apple. Uh, we do officially now have, uh, for the first time since January 22, a market cap above $3 trillion. That's a nice 1% gain. If our Art Cashin were here, maybe he'd have a cap for it to mark the, to mark the occasion. It's historical to get a $3 trillion stock. Haven't seen it before. Uh, no, it's uh, it, even looking on your screen, it's sort of a shocking thing to see three trillion dollars next to one company. But obviously, when you make uh, as much as a hundred billion dollars in income a year, then it gets a little easier to imagine how you got there. Uh, and that's where that's where Apple is. I mean, the numbers themselves, as I sort of say, whenever we go through um, the quarter, the numbers themselves are just staggering. The size of these companies, and it's not just Apple, Microsoft as well, Alphabet, Amazon, the size of them all. Um, and certainly in the case of Microsoft and Alphabet as well, in terms of their profit engine, is just staggering. Um, and Apple leads uh, there. And so, yeah, 30 times 100 billion, there you go. Three trill, that'll get you there. Um, whether or not it has more to go, uh, you heard Carl mention City at 240 price target. Uh, we'll see, but there is a belief that, that there is still growth to come, of significant growth to come.